Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of Farm Sim. Uh, today, for the most part, I believe, uh, seeing how we're doing all this by hand, um, we're going to be cutting some grass. Uh, I still don't have the baler, um, the stack wagon. I do have the John Deere with the forks. Uh, might be looking into a telehandler also. Um, and we got a whole bunch of uh, wheat and corn to chop. So, uh, due to the money situation, we're probably going to get a lot of this grass on the ground. Um, chop up a bunch of that wheat and sell what we don't need uh, and get the baler. So, that is basically what the idea is for today. put that guy down gonna unfold the rear looks good let me just start going here and make sure everything's on and working. Okay, the front one's mowing also. Alright. And that's right, the cabin. This thing kind of sucks. But due to it being the biggest machine I have at the moment, uh, we'll have to deal with it. The mirrors don't work. My door's wide open. The old AC and this thing must have crap the bed have to get that in the shop um, so yeah just gonna cut some grass here take off some of these bushes maybe I don't get hung up on them had a couple of subscribers come into the old team speak today very nice to see you uh, one guy was Lewis have a lot of interest in what we were doing. I uh, wanted to see some more logging, and I will get to that. It's not going to be an issue. Uh, like I said, I'm just kind of trying to find a good map to do it. I did have a uh, subscriber there, a gentleman, that uh, showed me a map, and I'm still uh, kind of waiting to play it. I've got it, but I haven't really tested it out. I've been doing a lot. Uh, I'll work on Landy's server because he forgot to turn the withering off and nobody had been in it in a couple days not knowing really what we were going to do for a map at the time so all the plants withered away um, so I've been basically cleaning all that up and uh, yeah And, uh, yeah, <laughs> lost track of what I was talking about there. Uh, the other guy that was that came in, uh, I, not good with names. Uh, I do know that he came in under Magnum Farming. Uh, we had spoke a little bit about uh, jumping into his multiplayer game. Um, he was having some computer issues. But uh, I think you guys will be seeing a little bit more of him. If his computer and internet all works out, we still haven't really tried anything as far as multiplayer or anything like that, so, um, yeah, that's all determined right there, but, uh, yeah, been a been a pretty good day. Uh, I've been looking at a GTA 4, been watching a lot of them videos, and playing quite a bit of Heroes and Generals, but, uh, GTA 4, I might, I might pick that up. There's a lot of mods out there for, um, like, uh, I believe it's called LCPDFR or something like that. Uh, it's a realistic, uh, basically, um, 
trooper or sheriff or whatever the heck you want to call it simulator um, and it's bringing it to a game that is completely not really meant to simulate anything you know GTA has always been known for the hookers the killing and just yeah <laughs> all the all the wrongs in the world I guess you'd say but uh, yeah I've been kind of checking that out I do have GTA 5 um, and that'll be coming out April 15th now I think they pushed that back again uh, but yeah I might pick up 4 that way I can try out this uh, LSPD FR mod whatever the heck it is and maybe get some videos of that going because that looks really really cool it's something that I've really never done before so we will see what that brings if I'm any good at it and if you guys enjoy it I might really get into it I know that would be uh, something that Deputy P would really love to get into uh, being right in his line of work there so and Landy Kid also uh, knows quite a bit about it I guess he's experimented with that mod quite a bit before so he can kind of walk me through it if I do get into it and if he still is into it but either way I did talk about a uh, I think it was a wind drawer no, no, no. Forge Harvest? I don't remember. Um, either way, it was a MoCo, John Deere MoCo, and I got it in the game, and it does not actually mow grass. It doesn't do anything, really, so that is basically out. So, for the time being, we've got this little beauty just uh, plugging away at her should get a good number of bales off of this field. I still don't really know. I might uh, get into the placeable buildings and actually get a uh, big warehouse type building for my bales. Um, but I, I don't. I don't really know what I'm going to do with them at this particular point in time. I guess we'll, we'll see when we get there. How many bales we get off these fields and what the uh, storage area would need to be. had a quite a few comments about the team speak uh, not really even I mean there has been one individual that's been asking quite a bit about it but everybody that's really asked has either joined or has had kind of problems so I just wanted to kind of clarify um, it's really nothing to download you just go on to teamspeak.com and uh, at the top right hand side you will see a download link and that download link is going to bring you to a bunch of different TeamSpeak layouts basically um, and you need to know what your system is as far as uh, if it's a 64-bit or a 32-bit and you're going to pick uh, TeamSpeak 3 client with a 62 or uh, 32 64 or 32 and uh, that's really it you download it, you get all logged in, whatever the heck you gotta do, I don't know if you need an email address or all that. Um, don't, I wouldn't recommend an Overwolf. Uh, I've had some issues with that with other people in the past. Um, and then, basically like I said, just get it all set up. Um, and then go up into your connections box and you take that little I don't know how many, 12, 18, whatever the heck it is, digit number that we've been um, trying to keep in the comment section. It's kind of hard 
when you gotta remember it and go into TeamSpeak and copy and paste it every video. But I've been trying to do it the best I can. Um, yeah, and just put it in the put it in the uh, connection box there. It's really nothing to it. And it is a public TeamSpeak. We are trying to get people in there to expand our uh, multiplayer, basically. If we approve, you know, um, there are certain requires or stipulations and whatnot. But uh, yeah, it's been few and far between the people that have been on. So. you uh, play respectfully, you are respectful, and, you know, we kind of jive. You may see yourself in a couple games with us. If not, you'd be in talking with us as we're playing. So, I mean, it's really a win-win if you love the game and you love to play, and you're looking for a realistic group of guys to play with, so... The offer is out there. It's just a matter of actually buckling down and doing it. And even if, say, uh, you are in uh, Magnum Farms situation where your computer may not work out, which I'm not saying it won't, we don't know yet. Um, but uh, either way, you can get into TeamSpeak. I mean, Deputy P, for instance, has a bad latency and internet connection a lot of the time but he's able to talk and do all that other stuff in TeamSpeak with really zero problems so even if you uh, can't play on a multiplayer or whatever but you just want to come in and talk and do that type of thing we've got rooms where you can do that and like I said if we're not recording we're normally kind of floating around unless uh, we do have somebody on uh, such as Bill or you know Bill he's on every once in a while he's not a uh, real regular but uh, if he's on he's usually asking me questions about the 110 or doing this and that and you know I've kind of got a little obligation to talk to him about that stuff because he, he's helped me out huge um, and I enjoy enjoy talking to him about that stuff so, uh, you know, give us a, uh, give us a poke if you're new. If you're not new, give us a poke if you uh, need some or wanted to talk to us about something, too. Uh, as long as we're, we do have uh, a couple restricted channels, um, and that's where we normally are in the TeamSpeak, um, just due to how many people do come in and when they are playing games and if we're in there it kind of mashes uh, and there is two channels that we do have a zero tolerance in the poking and messaging type deal like the channel that I'm in now is a uh, recording room for single player so if we get poked or whatnot usually it's a perma ban um, just because the channel is marked as a no poking perma ban type offense if we do get something like that because normally somebody is on that can help you um, but uh, yeah I mean everything's there for you uh, we do give out uh, the mods that we are using currently um, from inside the channel so uh, if y'all are kinda looking for any of the mods that we use we do have a uh, dedicated server box with all of our mods that are in the server um, and I've given that to uh, Lewis today and I also gave that to Magnum Farms so uh, if you guys are looking maybe uh, for mods that we used, we tested and turned out to be true that work perfectly fine um, we do offer, offer that also so like I said, it's kind of a win-win. Uh, we get some new people to talk to, new people to uh, maybe in the long run play with. Uh, and, uh, you know, we're uh, 
really open guys to uh, the public. We're not, you know, any better than anybody else. We're just here to have fun and play games together. So that's why we really opened up the team speak because Lewis was kind of blown away, you know, with all these big YouTubers and they kind of shut themselves away from the subscribers and they have their own personal area and we do like I said we do have our own little separate channels that we go into um, but I mean that's not really uh, you know restricting us from you guys that's giving us time to do what we need to do or to uh, discuss what we need to discuss with basically the guys that we've been with for the past four or five years you know Obviously, I'm going to talk to Deputy about stuff. I'm not going to talk to um, Lewis or Magnum Farms because I just met them today. So, you know, you do have to have a little bit of a uh, place to go where you feel comfortable. And, you know, I fall asleep quite a bit. Deputy falls asleep quite a bit. So if we're in them channels, we're not really worried about who's going to hear what in the background. Or So, yeah, either way. Like I said, I don't mean to be rambling on, but at least I'm talking tonight. That's the way I look at it, as far as team speak and me talking during the gameplay, because half the time I could really just sit back and listen to music and do the farming without saying a word. So, Getting pretty close to being wrapped up here. I think one or two more passes should do it. No, actually one. We'll do it. And I know I got a Ted and do the uh, windrows on this guy, but I'm gonna leave that for another day. This is quite a Quite a respectable field for grass. Um, I think what I'm going to do now is maybe get this feel the wheat get that guy all set hopefully uh, the combine will cooperate do a couple passes on the headland and let her go some more of that silage bumped up there. I'm going to put these lawnmowers right over here. Lawnmower attachments. Because I'm pretty positive this will not fit in a barn. I did buy a new trailer. It's absolutely horrendous looking. But it is a new mod. Lenny said it was fantastic, so figured why not. Give the old blue girl a little try out here. 
it's absolutely horrendous looking though, I will say that. Before I do that, I'm going to pick up his weight. Does this thing got IC controls? It does, cool. Let me see. Oh wow, we got duels. And my lower link is down. Perfect. was not aware this thing actually had duels. That is sick. One of my new favorite tractors. Alright. That's so screwed up that the IC controls are inside the cab. Aww. I really hope this trailer gets freaking dirty. That's what Landy was talking about. The airlines. It is really beautiful though. They have done a really nice job. <sighs> Would like to know how they aren't hooked up to nothing. That's weird. That stick in there, I don't know if you see it. I'm not even in the tractor and it's moving. It's gotta be a bug. Okay, so. We've got this guy with the Oka trailer. Oh, that's really cool. I'm so glad I got freaking duels. That makes me feel better. Okay. Enough drooling over that. All right. Fire up the old case here. Now, hopefully, I'll be able to take this field back a little bit too. just a little bit too tight. I don't really want to lose all that much room, but I'm not really that far off. Oh yeah, I was a little bit.
So yeah, we get into some Balaam sweet. For some reason, you guys love the Balaam. I think we should have quite a bit to do. Between the grass and the straw. machine is pretty sick. I was looking for new combines today. Well, I'm always looking on mod hosters and a couple other sites that I will not really mention because they take people's mods, but they're first come, first serve type of modding sites. So, uh, they'll even get mods that are premium mods. I call them premium mods. Um, well, unlike mod hoster, where mod hoster will um, kind of make sure um, I don't really know if they test every single mod per se but they uh, they don't really allow much crap and if it is crap it's usually taken down so um, yeah um, but these sites get mods Sometimes it's a couple days in advance before mod hosters, so uh, I check them out on a regular basis, probably twice, three times a day, just to see what new has kind of popped up. And you see, this is kind of why I wanted to make this row in between these fields bigger, it was uh, due to the take the drop off my tractor was due to the fact that I would need to get in here with tractors. starting to get dirty and this mod is brand new on mod hosters you can find it on just about any site now um, and you can't miss it <laughs> it is really ugly but I really do like the uh, the dirt and mud that comes off your wheels that's a really cool um, new feature that I haven't really seen uh, new texturing I don't know why these guys can't. You see how the fat inside wheels? I don't know why they don't match them up. I love a nice matched up tire. Here in the front, you can see how narrow that extra set of duels is compared to that front. Thing looks mean. Alright, so we'll take this guy and we'll park him. Same thing with the uh, tire tracks. You only see one row. Well, I mean, you see two there, but that's from the fronts. One, one set of tires is doing all that. Same with this guy too. I didn't even realize that. Front tires on him. Got a super single or a narrow on the outside. I mean, whatever. But that's one of them features that I really wish they would kind of spot or figure out why they do it so it doesn't make much sense to me
little bit uneven with that road. Try to make this as easy as possible for the AI or Herald to uh, get all this without making all these sharp turns here. On the second pass, we'll try to do it a little bit smoother. That way it's not so tedious for him because he's really quite the idiot. If I get two passes done, I'd just about be done in three or four passes, so. Hopefully we can get all the guys in working on that uh, multiplayer game soon for you guys. Get some more multiplayer action going. But it's really hard after I've done all this work on the server then to go onto that map and basically restart from the ground up. But uh, it's fun either way. Either way. I think I can get this right here. Uh, what was it, five? Okay, we're gonna have Harold do that. Gonna have him auto combine on. Right, yeah, on. Card on. Stop when he's full. There we go. So I really hope this trailer turns brown, that way you can't see the color anymore. That'd be sweet. And this trailer is supposed to heap. Which you can kind of sort of see there. Oh yeah. Although that would not last all that long coming off the side like that, but that heap is really what this game has really been missing. Oh yeah, and it actually got quite a bit of weight to her now too, which is very cool. Almost cartoony with that uh, dash. Not particularly the dash, but uh, the hood on this almost kind of looks like cartoon. I don't really know if I'm a big fan of that heap. Yeah, that just looks really way too. I don't know. It's getting out of the realistic looking field. I mean, you're going to make it that tall of a heap. You got to have boards on the side or something to keep that in there because that ain't, I mean. <laughs> It ain't like you're shooting snow in there, and what is 
the placeholder for the actual grain. Oh, why is he doing... Ah, well. I'd like to bring this in, but I kind of want to see how tall this heap is going to go, so I'm going to have to get unrealistic here and drive through the field. I really don't want to do that, but I kind of really want to see what this... Well, I forgot he will not keep going. It's not like my other herald. I kind of want to know how high this heap is going to go here. sketched out by that. That's just... Doesn't even look like it's for this trailer. Looks like they took the actual heap out of another trailer and just made it be so this trailer would heap that high. I mean... <laughs> this is really kind of bizarre. here 87 percent holy we're still not full is there anything else on this trailer no there's not there's no sidewalls or anything you could put up to kind of keep that in I just don't <laughs> that don't make no sense Trailer might be beautiful, but I don't really know. Well, it's not beautiful at all, but uh, that's beyond realism. There, that is definitely going about as far away from realism as farm sim is. Something, something's not right with that. <laughs> that is a massive heap. I don't know about that whole deal there. Wow. Well, I think the next thing that I'm going to do is see how dirty I can possibly get this trailer. And if it looks good dirty, I may keep it and not fill it up to 100%. But the only reason why I was going to use it or keep it is because Landy gave her a solid review. And maybe I don't have something right here. I did. I did. That just don't look right to me.
That just don't look right to me. get Harold going the proper way here instead of up and down. Let's try to get him to follow the proper route here. No, that's not the way I told you to go. No. That's why. turns real quick and then Bingo. Alright. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to just drive around a little bit. Kind of do a mod review on this trailer. Right now it's failing, even though it does look so good. I'm going to just see how dirty we can get this guy. realistic way of doing it, but all I'm waiting for old Harold there. I don't really have much I can do at the moment, so as you can see we got 85,000, so we're going to need the cash. seeing anything happening here. Pretty cool how they did that galvanized. See what I got for bale storage here. Really not too much. Um, I don't really know what I want to do here. Do 
whether I want to go with a haul. Let's see what this... That's pretty massive. Although we do have a good amount of area right here. Click rotate, huh? Where are the cows? That's another great question. Where are the cows? Biogas. Oh, another logging area. But this is really huge. So I don't even know if I want. Uh, I mean, I know I could store equipment in here, and I know I am kind of running short on that, but. Okay, biogas is there. Manure there. I think this is cow pasture. That's exactly what that is. There's peat and trough right there. So. We can delete it if we don't like it. Okay, so we're full. Harold's not full. Let me go see how that looks. If that looks absolutely ridiculous, we can move it, delete it, and get something else. Probably will look ridiculous, but... Man, it doesn't look that bad. It is way too close to the road, however, way too close to the road, okay, so, go to the garage, mm, we'll sell this, oh crap, it's really about as far. just do something here. I'm going to leave that there as a reference. Um, I know this is getting out of the realism, but I want to get this done. Sweet, I really didn't plan on actually putting down. I actually planned on just seeing if the tractors got dirty. So I'm going to remove just a little bit of it. And I'm going to plant grass over here. Just to cut all the sears and whatnot, plow over here. Oh boy.
texturing won't be the same, but um, oops. Play schools, yep. If I put it back here. Does that look alright? Oh crap, now I've really done it. Um and squared up again. Okay. Say there. Square. Yeah, it looks good. How much was this tractor? I actually really kind of like it. It's the first tractor that I've actually seen that. Holy crap. actually gets dirty and dirty dirty okay we do have the we do have the big chrome okay Kind of sort of lost track of what I was doing there. Okay. Oops. I might pick up another one of these guys. I really <laughs> it's starting to grow on me. It's amazing what a couple of duels will do for you. I like it. I've never been a fan of Fent. Never been a fan, but it's the first tractor that actually works playable and uh, has duels and gets dirty. And in my book, that's really what it takes to get a mod in my game. So, cool. Well, because I played with that IC control. I really hope that's not as dirty as this thing gets. If it is, it doesn't make too much sense, but... start this guy over here uh, I don't really know when I'm gonna end the video per se so I haven't really figured out I mean, it's far past my bedtime anyway I was kind of waiting to see uh, Magnum farming was gonna get back on tonight Now that I'm in here playing, I really don't want to stop.
little glitch spots that I ran into last time too. I don't know what that is. Unless this map is like a reskinned of reskinned reskinned version of uh, Born Home or Westbridge. I don't know what it's really hitting right there. So I noticed that in a couple spots. Kind of see it right there, hitting something. I did have a conversation today with Lewis, um, new new subscriber, but he uh, he ended up joining the TeamSpeak early on this morning, and uh, was talking to me about if I had uh, like a Facebook group or anything like that, and I really I yeah I got a personal Facebook and that's for family only that type of deal. really kind of low. Um, I don't know. I didn't have nothing like that. Uh, same thing with, you know, Twitter and all that other crap. I don't, I don't do any of that. And then he was mentioning to me about a Steam group. And my Steam is really more or less for my immediate friends on uh, the game. Like Bill, like Landy, like Deputy, and my 10th MEU regiment guys off of Lima. Um Yeah, so I keep that personal also. I don't I don't like the fact that I have to shut off my steam and all that crap when I record because I'm getting game invites and all that other stuff. Um so yeah, I don't I don't know. Uh he did kinda spark it in my ear. Um, about it, that it would be a good spot for you guys, uh, maybe to perhaps meet up and whatnot, uh, to play some games together and that type of deal. So I don't know. That, that might be something that I uh, look into. Um, I do have another Steam account that I may be able to make a uh, a group for. But uh, I'm not on that Steam at all. Really, it's only for my laptop. And at that time, I didn't have, or I made a Steam name. But when I actually started game computer, or playing games on a computer, um, I made a whole new one for my desktop, my first desktop. Um, so, yeah, I don't. Uh, I don't know. Let me know uh, if you guys would kind of like to do that. But uh, I kind of figured it would be the same way with um, the TeamSpeak. You know, just having the TeamSpeak open to you guys. And it is an open public server. Uh, I have had quite a few people asking me about that. You know, saying it was a bad idea and things like that. But uh, really, we haven't had any trouble. And if there's anybody causing trouble, we can ban them or kick them to make them think about what they were doing and figure out what they're going to do. Um, but yeah, so I don't know about a Steam group. I might do it. Um, Facebook page, I'm not into. Like I said, that's for immediate family. Um, and if I make a Facebook for 
rubber side down I I would never be on it I get all the notifications and I just I wouldn't participate because I don't participate in my own Facebook so I don't know I mean I can make a Facebook page just like anybody else um, so uh, I don't know if you guys want to get social with rubber side down I guess join the team speak um, but if you guys do have any ideas or would like to uh, I don't know talk amongst yourselves and have a place to do it let me know and I'll uh, I'll look into it um, I do think that steam would be kind of cool because you know we could get all you guys on there and uh, whoever's playing farm sim can jump in there and you guys can kind of go about it that way but uh, and it would be kind of quick to see uh, you know get some realistic farming going on some of y'all's own servers um, but uh, yeah I, I don't know just let me know what y'all think and like I said I'll do my best to kind of get some going you know even like the live streams I've been talking about that in my videos but I really haven't got any motivation to do it and then my time schedule when I actually play and when I'm researching and doing all this other stuff and rendering really kind of is uh, not planned it's just like tonight I didn't really plan on doing a video because I was going to take Sunday off but I just ran into some time and figured I might as well record a little bit and like I said last night it was going to be a longer one and it ended up being just about as long as the rest of them I figured well I'll just play it tonight and record it and see how that goes and it seems like it has been quite a while of me playing but I'm going to keep going And I don't know about the time change for y'all, but uh, we push the clocks ahead tonight, I believe. So when I started recording, it was 9 o'clock. It's going to be 10 o'clock. And probably when I get done, it's probably going to be around 11 or 12 because the time change. So, yeah, if you haven't done so, remember to do it. Because the boss at work told us to <laughs> not forget. Because that's a classic. Come in an hour late. Because you didn't realize the time change happened. That would have been nice. I think what I'm going to end up doing is getting in there for Harold and doing the rest of that because he's going to take all day to do this little section here. And we don't need to take a whole day.
Let old Mr. Harold get her done here. fields either. <sighs> Not seeing it get all that much dirty. Don't know about this trailer. Got quite a bit done tonight. <clears throat> quite a bit done. Probably in the next one we will get the corn all harvested off that field. Um, kind of hard. Kind of very hard. I don't know. Keep going there, Harold. Oh, you son of a gun, you gotta stop, don't you? Frickin' it. I don't know, uh, if I'm gonna be able to afford everything. have to sell something. Well, I do have a trailer here to sell. Because, like I said, I do not see this thing getting all that much dirtier. Kind of sucks. I was kind of... Well, I guess it's still getting a little bit. I guess we can harvest the rest of that field off. Um, let's see what happens. say if it wasn't for that heap the way it is, but really the thing I was hoping to get really dirty. I was really hoping to make some buku bucks off of this wheat too, but apparently we gotta switch it up to barley. Because we're only making maybe 10,000 a load here. Well that one was 60 something percent instead of being full, so maybe around 15 grand, I think, is he better, 128, trailer, yeah, I'll say around 20, so there's 140, holy crap, mm-hmm, 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 We've got some money to be making here. We've got some money we need to make. And not all that much time. So I 
think we can sell. That's good, that's good, that's good. We're gonna need the corn chopper, we need the chopper trailer. We don't really need that, but that's only... That's 2,000. 15, 3, 25. can sell that. Might as well sell this because I'm not really going to need that until we get another windstorm. Wink, wink. can sell this guy. Sell this guy because we haven't really used them all that much. This trailer. Oh, you know what? It did have sides. I just don't know how to do the sides. i seen them there too. Oh well, I didn't particularly care for it all that much. Um, it's only 32 thou. Seed. We got the... We got two sprayers. Okay. I can sell this guy for right now and get him back if I want him. Um... Okay, so that's going to actually really open up the door for us here. Um, so, now that I've got the money, I'm going to get the baler. Okay, and then I'm going to go into the mods, because I want to check out the mods and see what we've got. Oh, I do have these guys, too. Them are really cool. They all work very, very well. They do get dirty. This guy also, which I would kind of... Oh, really? Oh, that's cool. Let's do an OD green. OD green wheels. Kind of like a military. This guy's really cool. I don't know what I'd use him for, though. <laughs> I really shouldn't have gotten to the mods folder. This always happens. Um, talked about telehandlers. We need a bale trailer. Yeah, this guy does have walls. Hmm. And these guys I don't care for. I just kind of like that blue guy there. All decaled up. They're from 13. They worked really well, but I, I like more trailers like this. You know, realistic looking. Even though the landy will argue with me like these. That that trailer is realistic, but it just, I, I, I don't know. I'm not sold on it, I guess. All them implements come with them. <sighs> Tracked guys. Um, we got a big sprayer. We got them little guys. We do have a spreader. Oops. Um... Okay, bale trailers. Auto stacker. I really don't want to get into that. This guy, we kind of had an issue with it blowing up. But I don't... I don't think it was actually blowing up. I think what it was was the... Uh, truck hit it overnight. Too much forestry stuff. Junk trucks. This guy I haven't tried out. Landy swears that thing's amazing. And a conveyor. My excavator mats. My diesel tank. Um, total chain. And my placeable crap. Okay, so I do not have a tether. Or a windrower, so I'm gonna get that guy, and that leaves us with 6,000. And then what we gain from cutting these fields should be enough. Okay, I've really gotta get in here and shut this door. It's not bothering me per se, but it's kind of letting a draft in. Okay. 
So we got the wind roar. I need the tatter. We got the baler and I need a bale trailer. I really want to get another one of these now. Oh, yep, this trailer. Oh, he's already hooked up. I think this guy would be a little bit underpowered. Maybe it wouldn't be, but... Oh, that thing looks mean. It's like a great weight. A tiger shark. trailer looks so small now. I gotta try out that green and yellow trailer too. I miss it again. I did. with this guy. But yeah, I love the filthiness of it. That's freaking sick. <laughs> we should get dirtier. Just keep piling on the old mud. Does this guy actually have a... Uh... No, it doesn't. Already at 36% too. Hmm. It's gonna be right around maybe. I think the other trailer was full at 36,000. This guy might be around 32, 34. So we're gonna lose a little bit of capacity. see it get up to the 50% mark here. So you can see. Mm. Around 12. So maybe. Be 26. So maybe at the most 28 thousand it'll do which is still uh, respectable I mean see how that blue one just looked like it belonged in freaking Mr. Rogers or Pee Wee Playhouse color I, I, I yeah it was horrible um this just works and it does have uh, do -do 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 -do. does well that was tractor in my back oops Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Losing respect for that thing. Is it this? Register. Oh, that's kind of cool. Look at that.
cooperate here. That is really cool. I just don't know where to click here. That's really sick. Oh! <laughs> you gotta let her go. Sweet. I don't really know about all these, but. Is she a hamburger? I like me some hamburger. Yeah, cool. Sixteen. Cool. Whoops. Cool. Now does it show up? Wow, that is sick. That is sick. Alright. I could have swore there was a... Hmm. <laughs> I could have swore there was a, uh set of uh, tops for this trailer too in black actually I know there was I don't know how to get it I don't get it to work anymore though <laughs> 